what is good again everybody Tunji from Caesar graphics and welcome to my part two of how to transfer photoshop project to coral draw for print or for offset print i already have coral draw opened on my pc so i'm going to create a new document this is a large format project i'm going to make my unit inches and my width is going to be 118 by 97 all right so on the part one of this tutorial i explained the advantage of coming to coral draw before going to photoshop and the reason why it's always good to do this is because photoshop cannot handle large uh, project like this all right so it's always good to use a, a you know a light application to create the frame of the project and then you now take the project to photoshop and then transfer it back to this um, application so I'm going to make my color mode uh, to be um, CMYK and resolution is going to be 300, all right? And uh, my preview mode is going to be enhanced and I'm going to click on the create button. All right, now I am going to um, double click to on the rectangle tool to create a frame for me. I'm going to deselect the rectangle shape that I just drew and I'm going to change my unit to pixels because we are taking this to photoshop so what i'm going to do now is to select the object and i'll go to my frame here and change this to 6000 and i'll hit the enter key all right then what i'm just going to do is to copy the height all right i already know my width is 6000 so i'll copy the height and go to photoshop create a new document and i'm going to call this um let's say banner all right, and I'll paste my height here. Then I'll take out the comma and make this 6,000. All right, then my resolution is going to be um, 4,000. And because I actually want something more heavier, like I want the, you know, the project size to be bigger. All right, so I'm going to change my color mode to CMYK and I'm going to leave every other setting the way they are and I'm going to select the create button. I'm going to start work on the project now. In this tutorial, we'll be talking about TIFF, which is Tag Image File Format. Aside from making sure that the color mode of the project is set to CMYK, the file size of the project is also important. Saving your print project as JPEG is not bad, but the only time your file size comes big is when you use a large frame size. Unlike TIFF, file size always come large most printing press all over the world prefer this format not only because of the file size but because object comes in editable layers one of the disadvantage of till file is you can't use it on the web i'm going to save the project now so i'm going to go to file and I'm going to select save as it's already on banner so i'll just wait for it first and I'm going to select the save button now. So the only thing you just need to do here is just to click on the OK button and just say OK again. Then I'll open Coral Draw now. So I don't need this. And now I'm going to drag this and drop here like so. All right. Now, one advantage of um, you know doing this is this. So if I right click now and I go to properties now, if you check the file size, you see we have 126 mb which is very large all right so i'm going to cancel this and move this out of my screen now and i'm going to double click here
even have to you know take it to coral draw before saving the you know project you can as well send the file to the printing press like that and it will still you know work for whatever they want to use it for okay so i hope you enjoyed today's tutorial and uh, if you have not subscribed remember to hit the subscribe button and remember to you know click the post notification bell so you will be notified when i post my tutorials share like and comment on this video i'll see you again in my next tutorial peace